and that is a different, different lift that he brings. Welcome back, lovies, to today's video. I'm so excited to bring you to this, or bring this to you. Um, I'm not sure if it's still um, for sale or if it is sold out, but I got it within like a couple days of getting it. I put it up. I have not been feeling well. My asthma has been bothering me all again. So let's just go ahead and get into it. If you are new here, please consider ringing that bell, subscribing, and liking the video, as well as leaving me a comment. And then I'm doing my um, giveaway on my Instagram. And if you guys are not following me, this is my Twitch. This is my Instagram. This is my uh, TikTok, as well as my Twitter. It is pretty much for everything I have, except for my Facebook. My Facebook is just my name. So, let's get into this already. But I was just saying that. And if you're not new, welcome back, my lovelies. Mwah, 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 mwah. Glad to see you back. Sorry if the angle changed, but I had to. I knocked my dang uh, work brain work. I knocked it over when I was getting some baby wipes to wipe my hand off. I wanted to make it closer anyways, so now I got to. Okay, first we're going to start with the things I bought. This is the Juvia's Place Nourishing Lip Balm in the shade Passion Fruit. So, so much you get. Not a ton, but doesn't take a bunch because you can see, I hope, how it melts when it touches your lips. Okay, our next thing is the packaging is kind of falling apart. But this is the Rosy Posy New Liquid Blush. They had so many shades. Look at that fat, fat boy right there. I like those kind of doe foots. Here's what it looks like compared to the, looks more lighter, mauvier in the um, picture online and in the bottle. But it's supposed to be a rosy pink. Good lord. Good loudy moldy. This it stuff spreads. Look at that. I put on the littlest bit. Like it might have looked like a lot, but it wasn't. Probably should have did the makeup last. Like look how much this spreads. My goodness. That little bit I put on. Wow. Beautiful. So we're going to wipe it all off and I'll put a tiny dot on. Eye primer, okay. I didn't know that I got the eye primer, but I guess I did. I got it in color too, which looks dark as hell. Looks like this. They're very watery that I remembered. So you've got to squeeze them up real good. Look at that. That's straight water. Oh, no way in hell can I use this. Look at the color on it. I'm still going to put that little bit that's on the lid. That way, if somebody still wants it, they can have it. Oh, yeah. I don't know if that would work for me. So, I put them back in their packages so I can do TikToks after. I sculpt eye shade. Let's check this out. And it is in the shade dark brown. I think that's what it says. It looks like this. That They have beautiful brown colors. And I just bought a bunch of pens from Eye Art Revolution. Or eyebrow pencils, I should say. And only one of them, maybe two, could work out of the four I bought. Yeah. Anyways. Look how thin that is. Let's see how thin we can make it. I'm going to do down here. Not too bad. Let's see. And you can make them even thinner. Okay, I'm filling this. And look at the color. It's like a, I don't know, it kind of looks like it has a greenish brown. But I think it's a primer. Because in real life, it just looks dark brown. I am so happy that that will work because I've got the shade of my brows. I have really dark hair, so I have dark brows. I used to go dark brown into a little bit lighter brown and then taupe on the inside. Or even a dark brown on the edges. And then um, blonde right here and then taupe on the edges. Or vice versa. Taupe and then blonde. But I stopped doing it because it was 
so much work to use so many different pencils. Now we got that. And this is my um, lip liner. It's called a Lux liner in Lush. And the description, and it described itself as a mauve mauve nude or mauve something. But let's open it up and see what we think. If it looks just too dark when I open it, I just won't even swatch it. Oh no, I'm gonna use this for sure. Just looks like I don't know on candle on candle. I don't know on camera if it does, but in real life it just looks like a straight mauve. So let's try it on. And we'll finish the rest and then I'll be back. Okay, loves, I'm glad that I didn't have you watch me. It took me like 20 minutes. But it's only because I tried on different lip glosses and things like that. Didn't like it, took it off, put it back on, yada, yada, yada. But this is just the lip liner. That is gorgeous. And that is in the shade Lu No, this is the Lux liner in. It's the Lux liner in Lush. There we go. So that was all the things I bought. The, um, not my shade, eye primer. The lip, the lip, yeah, the lip balm in Passionberry. The beautiful liquid blush in Rosy Posy. I don't know if they all look like that, but I'm thinking they do because this comes in the exact shade blush that the cam, or that the packaging is. So, we got the lip liner in, what is this? I want to say Lush again, but Blush is Eye Sculpt, Eye Shade, and Dark Brown. Now, let's get to the mystery. I'm excited. Put a little bit of lip balm. It wasn't drying at all. Oh, and there is the shades of the lip liner. Okay, so this is what we see. Now, this is the mystery box. Oh, no. I think maybe the uh, eye primer came with it. I don't think I bought that. But I know I bought the blush. I know I bought the lip liner. I know I bought the lip balm. And I got the... Let me see. I bought the palette. The lip liner. I bought the lip balm. I bought the liquid blush. Okay. Oh no, I guess the brow pencil came in the mystery box. Okay, so I got a palette, the eyebrow pencil, the um, eye primer, and a palette. That's what I got for the mystery box, which that was well worth it. Look, I bought one because I've been wanting it, and it would be perfect for spring. And I did not pay attention. The name of the mystery box is the Garden of Juvies. So, I'll open one to swatch and show you. I'll keep one closed for the mystery. Or for the, um, or not mystery, but the giveaway on Instagram. First, look at this freaking packaging. Come on. I'll wait. Take in a gorgeous look of the Garden of Juvies. And look at that beautiful lady. And that headpiece, oh my gosh, the packaging is amazing. It says either 24 or 34. Again, the, like, come on, see the gradient with the green, pink, oh no, wait, yellow, pink, green, blue. And it's like a matte feel with a little bit of glossy, I don't know how to explain it. Oh my God. Oh my God, no wonder I've been wanting to pick this up. Because you already know we swatch it, baby. We're going to do it how we always do it. I'm going to start from the left to the right. Then same. No. No. Do I, I don't want to do that. 
I want to go up and down the colors. Look. Purple. Purple, pink, green, and the orangish and yellows, right? Something like that. But let's go ahead and swatch. Now we're going to do it the way I said. The purple row, purple into pink, into an, like a nudish color. Green into another darker nude. And then the yellows into the oranges. They feel kind of, um, I don't know how to explain it. They feel kind of putty, but they feel kind of, damn it. We might have to get a second swatch of that since I just pressed it. Maybe not. Holy hell, that's a bright ass yellow. Because you could see where I stuck it to my finger. That damn yellow has got some pigment day, if I must say so. Here is the whole yellow row after being swatched. Okay, next row is the bluish and the greens. I hope whoever wins this on Instagram actually posts colors or posts pictures of getting it and them doing swatches. I'd love to see what they think. See if they think they feel like silky. Let me get a little bit more of that. The mats feel silky, but, um, like, silky, but kind of moist, but have the same matte feel as the outside packagings of matte do. Okay, there's the next four. Look at the shift there. Look at that purple shift. Here's the second, here's the second row, the blues and greens, and that neutral at the end. Next four. This is a beautiful row. Put another quote. Another coat. I swear, I need to quit making videos at night. Because I am so horrible at night making videos. Can't say nothing right. You're probably not going to see that nude transition. You can't see it at all. It's right there. It literally blends in with my skin. Get another swatch. Yeah, you can see it now. Right there. Under that, like, goldish color. Here's the third row. This one right here. And now we're doing the all purple row. And we're done. The last four. Ooh, that's a beautiful row. Don't know if they're all going to fit, but we're going to try. We should be able to get them all to fit. That is a beautiful periwinkle shimmer. There's another purple mat. Oh my gosh. I didn't get no more. I'm just trying to blend it out a little better. Oh, wow. This is gorgeous. Now I am going to go and tell you the names of each one. So, one, two, three, four. So, here to here. The names are, so from here to here, this is the first row. We have, we have daffodil, flower petals, sunshine, marigold. That's the first row. Now, from here, one, two, three, four. From there to there is the second row. We have Best Buds, Money Tree, Lucky Clover, Oh Honey. And then our third row starts one, two, three, and there is a fourth one there. It's just hard to see, but you can see it. Blooming, Peony, Blossom. And gardenia and the last row goes from here to there we have lilac you purple orchid flower child and sweet lilac and there is our palette god that is stunning you guys wow 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 okay i'm gonna put this back into the packaging 
So that was everything, you guys. Tell me what you thought. Was that a gorgeous palette or what? And yeah, I will say that that is a stunning palette. Everything about it, about it, everything about it is just absolutely gorgeous. And I'm so glad to have it. I'm so glad to have it. Come on, work brain, work mouth together. Um, just is so stunningly gorgeous. I wish I would have paid attention and known that that was what it was. So I wouldn't have bought a second one, but I always don't mind giving back to you guys. So look at that orange and that pink and that purple and a couple other ones. They do stain. So make sure that you're using a primer. That's why they get probably that's probably why they gave you the primer to go with the palette because it stains. Look at all them that stained. The yellow, the green, that's an orange, pink, purple, just a bunch of different ones. But that was everything for the Juvia's Place April Spring Mystery Box. I'm pretty sure it was $25. I'll put it down there if it was something more. And like I said before, do not forget to subscribe, hit the like, hit the notification bell so you know when I pick the winner, and leave a comment down below. But if you're not new, welcome back, lovelies. You know what I say. I love to see you all here. And so we can communicate. Say, hey, hi, how are you? Let me know. And with that, loves, I'm going to get out of here. But let me know what you thought about that mystery box. Would you easily pay 25 And I will link it in the description to know if it's still in stock or not. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one, loves. Bye.